despite frustrated and facing an invasion of roaches. A resident at an apartment complex near Maryland Parkway in Sahara says the critters have taken over his unit and have made it unlivable. And thank you for joining us live at 11 tonight here on Channel 13. I'm Trisha Keen. Our Alyssa Bethencourt visited the property and shares what exactly is being done to get rid of the roaches. The property management team here at the Solaire Apartments knows about the issue. However, the tenant we spoke with says they are not doing enough to stop the spread of these roaches, and now the problem has gotten out of hand. Robert Taylor moved into this unit at the Solaire Apartment Complex in East Las Vegas back in February. At the time, it was just him, but now he says he has roommates, dozens of them that have taken over. This is the most ridiculous thing I have ever seen before in my life. Taylor claims the cockroaches started showing up in mid-August after thunderstorms flooded areas of the complex. Since then, he says he's found them in every corner of his house, but mostly in the kitchen and living room. Falling asleep on myself or watching TV and four o'clock in the morning, I wake up to roaches biting me. While interviewing Taylor, we saw firsthand what he's been experiencing. A cockroach climbed up the wall in front of us. This all is what it. you're living with. All of it, all of it. I'm like, when is it going to end? When is it going to end? I'm doing everything humanly possible to kill him. Because of the infestation, Taylor says he's had to throw away food and some personal items. He fumigated his apartment once and then property managers sent a team over too. But the problem hasn't improved. I am not going to live like this. I refuse to live like this. We reached out to property management and received a statement Wednesday afternoon. It reads in part, the resident in question received two complete cleanouts as well as a pest control treatment. A second treatment is scheduled but must be delayed from the first treatment to ensure full efficacy. A full inspection of the entire building was also performed and it also received a full pest control treatment with a second treatment forthcoming. We anticipate introducing additional solutions shortly. Now, Robert believes a visit by a maintenance worker earlier this week to seal up some gaps was a result of him calling Channel 13. If you're wondering what kind of rights a tenant has in this situation, we've posted those details up on our website at KTNV.com. Reporting in East Las Vegas, I'm Melissa Bethencourt.